Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, wherever you may be. Yeah, get that. Um, so another week has gone by, another, trying to get that, jeez, <laughs> there we go. Um, another batch of trailers for cool stuff. So let's do some reactions, reviews. So first we have, and how did that, there we go. How did that get out of place? I don't know that. But anyways, um, <laughs> uh, first we have Dragon Ball Daima, a new Dragon Ball series that's coming in October, apparently. So like I said, for myself, uh, I mean, anime lovers in general, throughout the year when they release things, there's always a good time. But uh, I mean, for those who I know have similar tastes to, as I do, you know, like I said, October shaping up to be really fun, uh, again, the third core of Bleach, uh, Thousand Year Blood War arc, the conflict comes out. Uh, I believe uh, SAOA, uh, GGO, Sword Art Online alter Alternative, Gun Gel Online, uh, Season 2. Um, there was something else I was thinking. There's something else that comes out in October 2, and, but it's skipping my, my brain right now. And then, so we have Dragon Ball. So, yeah, let's go ahead and check out this new trailer for Daima. And here, hold on. It's acting stupid. Do do do. Okay. <laughs> Cheapy versions of everyone. <laughs> Looks good. Nice and clean. Supreme Kai. Yeah, oh yeah. Hmm. And again, prominently Goku has his powerful back. much more has been revealed, I mean, as, as far as story-wise, what we're getting. Again, you know, the main thing we know that apparently, I don't know about all, but a lot of the main players, uh, if you will, have been turned to kids. So, um, again, as you see here, you know, Goku, Supreme Kai, Kabito... Vegeta, Piccolo, <laughs> you know, um, so yeah, very interesting premise to begin with. The animation looks great, so, and again, of course, it's by uh, Kira Toriyama, uh, so that's a plus, of course, because, you know, again, famously, <sighs> okay, yeah, and I have to look this up again, I, I think I've seen things Either way, you know, as far as Dragon Ball GT saying, you know, forever it was held as not canon. And then I thought I saw some place where they said that he, supposedly that Toriyama said it is kind of canon, but it's technically down after, I mean, after um, Dragon Ball Super, which, timeline-wise, so which I'm kind of like, mm. but, um, you know, again, famously, and I never did finish Dragon Ball GT for various reasons. I'm sorry, that my collar's just kind of annoying me right now. There we go. That looks better. I think. Kind of. No. Anyway. Um, you know, so Dragon Ball G GT, famously, you know, Akira, Tor Akira Toriyama wasn't really a part of that. I think there's like a small little bit he had to do with it, but very small and, you know, hence why it was considered not canon. Um, which In which, you know, Emperor... Pilaf, uh, you know, uh, uh, makes the makes the wish that ends up uh, turning Goku back to a kid, and then you know, uh, he, Pan, and Trunks go on a galaxy-wide adventures to find the Black Star Dragon Balls, and 
you know, a lot of stuff happens, including we get Super Saiyan 4 and yada, yada, yada. But again, as I said, that was essentially thought of as non-canon by many people. But again, I could swear I've seen a couple places where that may or may not be the case. But so I'm saying similarly here in Daima, we have that similar element, except it's not just Goku, it's everybody. So I'm wondering if it is kind of like a new reworking uh, to supplant GT um, completely, <laughs> you know, so there is no question of whether it's canonicity or not, because um, it has such similar, at least the uh, initial premise, um, or again, if it's, you know, obviously completely different, and then they're, I don't know, you know, anyways, but um, like I said, anime looks clean, you know, very interesting. I, I am, I'm surprised to see, I will say this, as much as Dragon Ball loves his transformations, <laughs> you know, that in these little teasers, we didn't see any uh, kid transformations, um, you know, Goku, Vegeta, uh, or not Piccolo with his orange, <laughs> you know, or, or whatever. And I mean, I don't know whether, we, I mean, we may see that. I'm, I'm pretty sure we're probably going to see, <laughs> you know, that. Now, whether what the, you know, whether it'll just be Super Saiyan, I mean, for the Saiyan, Super Saiyan 1 or Super Saiyan 2, um, or more and we go into god and blue and all that who knows but yeah i'm just really interested to see what this is and what the story is so that is my sorry if it's slightly nonsensical <laughs> reaction and thoughts to the new uh trailer to dragon ball daima which will be coming out in october of course i will be watching that um as always feel free to share subscribe hope you give me a like if you like my content hit that notification button if you have sub subscribed so thank you and feel free to leave a comment below let me know what you think of the new trailer for dragon ball daima whether you're a friend fan of the dragon ball um franchise or you're not so as always thanks for watching